Part configuration. Part configuration allows designers to easily manage the status of a variety of different parts. Firstly, let's create a part configuration and give it a name, no counter bore. Double click to activate it and edit. Add the features hole one and mirror one. Check it to suppress. This is the result without counter bores. Create another one and name it Big Base. Activate, then edit. Uncheck these since no features need to be suppressed. Add the Block 1 feature and its dimensions are available. In this table you can modify them directly. Let's check it. Next, a 2D sheet. In the advanced table, part configuration can be set. Quickly get other projection views. Create another 2D sheet in the same file. Now you can get views with different part configurations. It is very convenient. Next, let's see how to use it in an assembly. In Assembly Manager, right-click the component and you can directly assign the part configuration used on this assembly environment.